I found a damaging hadith in Musnad Ahmad ibn Hanbal that I wanted to share with you, proving that Muhammad is nothing but the prophet of Satan. In Sunni Islam, you have four major schools. You have the Shafi'i, the Maliki, the Hanafi, and the last one, the Hanbali school. Imam Ahmad ibn Hanbal happens to be the founder of the Hanbali school. So he is one of the four giants of Sunni Islam. So let us see what the hadith in his Musnad has to say. By the way, don't worry, I will provide the link to this PDF file in the description box. You can find the PDF file in the description box on page 1119 of this PDF version. This is volume 3 of Musnad Ahmad ibn Hanbal, hadith number 15967. Enjoy. An Abi Rah al Kalai Kala Salla Bina Rasulallah Salla Allahu alayhi wa sallam Salla Fakara fiha surat al room Falabasa alayhi Baduha Kala Inama Labasa alayna shaitanu Al Kira Min Ajli Akwamin Yatuna as Salla بغير وضوع فإذا أتيتم الصلاة فأحسنوا الوضوع And here is my English translation Allah's Messenger prayed for us and he recited Surah Al-Rum which is chapter 30 of the Quran the Romans Satan corrupted the recitation Satan added his own words in the recitation of Muhammad simply because people came to pray without performing ablution Again, this is Musnad Ahmad ibn Hanbal, hadith number 15,967, volume 3. So according to this hadith, while Muhammad is reciting Surah Al-Rum, which is chapter 30 of the Quran, Satan started to cast down on his tongue satanic recitation only because people came to pray without performing evolution. That is the only reason simply because some people decided to not wash their hands, for example, before praying? Hmm. Clearly, he, Muhammad, became a prophet of Satan, looking for all kinds of excuses, blaming others for the satanic recitation that he received from Satan himself. <laughs> he was like, whoa, oh my God. I was like, Can you imagine the so-called best of example, the best of creation, not knowing the difference between Satan and Allah and confusing the satanic verses that he was receiving with the Quran? Muhammad was getting confused because some people forgot to wash themselves. They forgot to do evolution. And because of that, Satan has all the power to cast down satanic verses on the tongue of Muhammad. Muhammad was receiving satanic verses because some people forgot to wash their hands. Really? Is that the only excuse that Muhammad had for the people? He was looking for all kinds of excuses to save himself from the satanic verses that he received. And you can find the satanic verses mentioned also in the Quran in chapter 22, ayah 52. And Muhammad was looking for all kinds of excuses, blaming all kinds of people for him, not knowing the difference between Satan and Allah. Yeah, Muslimin, please wake up. I want you to think. I want you to start thinking. Try to give yourself a chance and allow your brains to function. And I'm sure you're going to leave Islam today. People, please download this video, share it all over social media. Let it go viral. Let it go viral. We need to help these Muslims. Muslims, we don't hate you. Please wake up. This is your soul. This is your salvation. Please drop Muhammad, the most obvious, the most obvious fake prophet in history. And come back home to your Lord and my Lord, Jesus Christ.
Thank you for watching and God bless. And by the way, don't forget to share this video on social media. Let it go viral. Thank you for watching.